So the lineup for the Daily Mirror Sporting Life Greyhound Derby final for 1995. In trap one was Pearl's Girl, trap two Mustang Joe, trap three Moaning Lad, trap four here Shawnee, trap five Curry Hills Fancy and trap six Summer Hill Joy. There was plenty of interest on the night for Moaning Lad back from three to one down to five to two but Pearl's Girl in trap one was sent off the two to one favourite. And away we go and racing up towards the first bend. Trap one, Pearl's Girl gets a flying break from the boxes ahead of two. Mustang Joe, then comes six. Summerhill Joy as they go around the first two bends and Pearl's Girl in front, but now being joined and passed by Summerhill Joy. After this comes Mustang Joe, Moaning Lad making a move. And so here's Shawnee going for a gap on the inside as they go around the second last bend. And Summerhill Joy races on with Moaning Lad. Here's Shawnee finds no room at that third bend. So three, Moaning Lad takes up the lead and starts to go away from Summerhill Joy. Moaning Lad's going to win the Greyhound Derby. Great performance from Moaning Lad winning it from Summerhill Joy in second and staying on back in third was Curry Hills Fancy. What a wonderful performance from Moaning Lad who is third to moral standards in last year's Greyhound Derby final. Trained by Theo Menses, he didn't break so well did Moaning Lad as expected Pearl's Girl was the leader as they ran into that first bend being chased by Summerhill Joy on this near side and Mustang Joe switching towards the rails position you can see at the moment Moaning Lad's racing in fourth Curry Hills Fancy slowly away along with here's Shawnee as they went down the second bend already uh, Pearl's Girl's picked up by Summerhill Joy that was a surprise for many of the Pearl's Girl uh, supporters on the night and Summerhill Joy was leading them down to that third bend but you can see Moaning Lad beginning to cruise up on the outside moving swiftly into second spot here Shawnee doesn't get much of a run at that third bend squeezed by both Mustang Joe and Pearl's girl they're involved in the trouble there that allows Curry Hills Fancy to gain third spot but as they come off the final bend Moaning Lad has just taken up the lead from Summerhill Joy and starts to pull clear a great performance from Moaning Lad who was only beaten once in the competition in 1995 by Pearl's girl uh, only beaten ahead in the semi-final so Moaning Lad wins the £50,000 prize there's the details of that victory the winning time 28.66 the going rated 10 spots fast and the winning distance three quarters of a length so Moaning Lad winning the 1995 Greyhound Derby for Theo Menses and the headlines in the sporting life Moaning the Magnificent well let's return to Wimbledon for some of the after race celebrations and the first to give Moaning Lad a big hug of course was Andrew Menses that's the uh, son of uh, Theo gets down on his knees gives Moaning Lad a big kiss and uh, congratulated by the connections of uh, all the losers the vanquished and uh, very sportingly as well so uh, Moaning Lad winning the Greyhound Derby for 1995 an incredible record don't forget he finished third in last year's final behind moral standards and perhaps an unlucky loser as well he looked very dangerous in the closing stages and uh, this year he was only beaten once in the competition that was in the semi-finals only touched off by Pearl's goal you can see there uh, Andrew Mentz is overjoyed Moaning Lad just got a slight spook there when the cheers of the crowd went up and again still minutes afterwards or you, you can see that Andrew Mentz is overcome with joy there tears swelling up in his eyes and a moaning lad well he just seems to be taking it all in in front of the main stand there I think it's a worthy pat on the head there and then of course the usual lap of honor for the derby victors and moaning lad winning the greyhound derby and the uh, co-owners holding the trophy aloft Theo Mentz is in there somewhere as well and at the end of the day the pictures for the papers a big cheer for moaning lad well let's review the action one more time the Greyhound Derby will join the race. The Greyhounds are all in the boxes. We'll just leave you with the crowd effects from Wimbledon Stadium.